Hi guys, so I said I'd do a tour of the RV, and here we are, we're in the RV now, and um, for those of you who don't know me following my blog, uh, my name is Michael Chase, I live in an RV, I have three Chihuahuas, uh, Biddy, Chico, and Hawkeye, and uh, I live in here with my girlfriend, Melissa. She's here, not here right now, she's at work, so I've done this tour for the video, and here we go. Tour of the RV I live in. It is a little messy, so please excuse the mess. And as always, I have my three chihuahuas. This is Chico. This is Biddy. And this is Hawkeye. I also wanted to go over what do I do for TV, internet, and entertainment. Um, I have an unlimited plan through Sprint. Uh, I don't have any throttling of my data on my plan. It's actually in my contract. And I just wanted to show you how I've gone over 50 gigabytes according to that. That right there is just from December 17th to 23rd. And as you can see, I use 17.7 gigabytes um, between those dates. But that's for the whole month, I went over 50 gigabytes. And as you can see here, most of it's all on PDA Net Plus, which I use a tether. And a lot of people I've had people tell me, oh, well, tethering is slow. Uh, you're gonna not get as the speed that you would get through Wi-Fi, but that's actually untrue. I use the tether through my computer, and I also use my computer for a Wi-Fi. Right now I've got my TV going, which is not in full screen. Uh, I connect this through my computer on HDMI, and uh, at the same time I can come down here and I can do other things through my computer, such as uh, I don't know check my Facebook so I'm gonna to go to Facebook and I'm going to show you how quickly it loads and just like that my Facebook page is open there might be a slight lag compared to like if you were at home on the internet or anything but at the same time you got to consider that I am watching TV and streaming through my computer while surfing the internet. Everything I do with my computer, nothing ever seems to stop this from playing, ever. It always continues to play. Now, to answer any question that you might see that, I don't know, I've got another TV. Well, the reason why I have another TV is because I have my game systems and my game consoles. And sometimes I like to, you know, play a game, watch TV, and be observant to what's going on on the internet. And, one of the things that I do is build web pages. I'm a web a web developer, so you know, if I can't view what I'm going, what you know, I can't do my work, or I can't see where I am of my work, can be a problem. So when I got my phone, it was very very important that I got unlimited, unthrottled internet. And a lot of people will say from what I've searched online, you know, because I have a daughter who's about to start online schooling. And uh, she is not exactly got a phone that's got unlimited internet. So we've acquired one. Um, we acquired an, a, a Boost Mobile phone that actually has the same plan that my Sprint phone does. And I've been looking into it and I've been working it and I've been putting it to the test to make sure that everything works out because when it comes to schoolwork, she's got to be able to finish her schoolwork and get it in on time. Um, if she doesn't, then, you know, she could fail, and that right there is a big problem. So, a lot of the things that I've done is I've hooked it up to my computer, I've ran the speed test and everything on the, th the using the, the tether feature instead of using the Wi-Fi feature. Um, my internet speeds are great, excellent. Uh, the fact that the TV itself is working, um, my computer is working just fine, as you can see. I'm going to let you see what my internet, if you can see, I have one bar on my phone. I don't know if that's showing or not. I do have LTE, but only one bar on my phone. As you can see, sometimes it'll disappear for just a slight second and come right back. But never once does it ever interfere with the internet signal on the computer or on the TV. Um, I'm always using it uh, daily every day the second i wake up it's connected the second i go to sleep i disconnect it you know i do that because you know i don't want to continue to use something when i'm not even awake to use it 
So I'll go to watching uh, TV uh, right before going to bed, usually off of the antenna on local channels, um, which there's plenty and you can get them and they're free. Uh, the key is to have you a good amplified antenna. Uh, you can get an antenna for your roof or you can get an antenna that you stand up yourself off the back of your RV. But the key thing is, is that no matter which antenna you get, if you really want to get good signal, you must have one of these bike devices right here. Um, they make them in different sizes and different shapes. Mine has a signal meter on it to where I can boost it up and I've got, as you can see, boosted to the completeness. I just bought this not too long ago. I haven't peeled all the stickers off of it, but there you go. Very snowy day today. Bicycles hanging from the side of the RV. Really pretty. I would say more than an inch. Hey guys, tonight I'm making potatoes O'Brien, and I do it a little bit differently than everybody. Um, I tend to make hash browns, and I cover it the hash browns with the mixture that I make. Well guys, that's it for the video. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching. I do plan on putting out some more videos here as soon as it gets warm weather. But until then, my videos are going to be slow coming, um, mainly because the RV that I'm in is a loner. It's not an RV. Um, we're trying to save up to get another RV. If you've watched any of my previous videos, you'll see the storm damage and stuff that occurred to our RV before it was actually hit by our hurricane. So, until we've actually got our money saved back up to get another RV, this is where we sit. Um, but I just wanted to go through the RV and kind of show everybody what it looked like and, and everything. And as you can see, um, the refrigerator is right over there, stove, kitchen, that's a dinette, and the bathroom is right through there. So, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time.